what's up guys cash back again and first off thank you guys for all the birthday wishes i definitely appreciate it and thanks for bearing with me while i celebrated for a few days but today we finally got the teaser trailer for thor love and thunder which was amazing of course but not only did it get me excited for the upcoming movie but because of the rumors about jane foster being the first hero content plan to drop this year for avengers i believe that now that the trailer is out the teams over at crystal dynamics and marvel games will want to start cashing in on the hype by officially revealing her as the next hero if that's ultimately the direction they were looking to go because we've got no official news on what to expect next there's been a lot of unofficial news and speculation surrounding the game's future but if you caught my last video you know that marvel games has a firmer hand on the steering wheel allegedly and have been the cause of the content drought due to their insistence on holding off certain content in order to release it closer to their marvel disney content which lines up with rumors that spider-man's development was complete months before his actual release and that the decision was made to delay his release until closer to December when No Way Home would release. So far, we haven't heard much about Patch 2.4 outside of a hint from developer Brian Wagner during his interview on the Excelsior Now podcast, where he teased that one of the things the team will be focusing on for Patch 2.4 is making the recurring events like the Red Room Takeover and Corrupted Vibranium more rewarding for players, which seems to suggest that the next patch will again focus on making things a bit more engaging for newer players while throwing in a few changes geared towards veteran players. So it's unclear if we'll see a new hero or content by even May because we're almost out of April and they have made no announcements about upcoming content and there's still no official roadmap. So now you have to question what the release schedule of content will look like on a roadmap that doesn't start until May or later. But hopefully we get some news on future content either this week or next just so we can at least say we know where things are going and we can have things to actually be excited for but I also have my own theories about what the future of the game could look like according to what we've seen so far and based on things they seem to touch on in the game's prequel novel but as always i want to hear you guys thoughts on things do you think the release of the thor trailer opens the door for them to officially reveal their plans to add jane foster to the roster or are you still doubtful she's actually a playing hero let me know down below and make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe to catch more marvel's avengers content every week thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one